So next, uh, let me show you what we uh, will need to create everything. So uh, if I open the game, if I play the game and start the game, and um, you see the game has these cubes, and you jump from one to the other, and this one is moving, so it's basically another cube. One is stationary, and you have this cube uh, that you can take it, and uh, this sphere here. Uh, and the large pillar uh, that you need to go to it there. Also, we have a timer that we need to create as well. Uh, and uh, we have this weapon and ammo, ammunition. Also, this uh, big uh, wall behind to know that you don't need to go there. And yeah, that's uh, all we need. So uh, let's get uh, started creating all these assets first. Uh, so yeah, so let's locate uh, everything that we need first. Uh, and the first thing I'm going to locate is the cube. You actually, uh, we are going to use a cube from the control rigs uh, in Unreal Engine. And yeah, you can find it if you go to Engine Plugins, and then find Control uh, Rig. I think. Uh, it's uh, this one, to control rig content, and uh, then here go to controls, and here you have all these uh, uh, things, assets that you can actually use. We also have a sphere here, so we can use this sphere as well, and uh, this control uh, rig cube as well. We can duplicate them, so we don't uh, actually uh, move anything from the folder, and go to jump cubes. Oops. No, uh, you actually don't go to jump cubes. You select them again and open jump cubes. And in the assets, we need to drag and drop them just in this folder. And now we have them in our folder here. So uh, this is basically all the assets that we need uh, for the models. And uh, the other things uh, like VFXs we are going to create later. So next, let's create actually the materials. Uh, they're very simple material. Uh, it cannot be any more <laughs> simple than this. Uh, if you go, uh, just create it and uh, name it uh, go, just go. That's all we need. And here, all we need to create our epic material <laughs> is if you press and hold three on the keyboard and just press with the left mouse button, you summon this uh, vector uh, node here, and this will be our cover. And plug it to emissive. That's our uh, material. We can actually make it uh, uh, like unlit, uh, but uh, yeah, actually, if we make it unlit, uh, it will be optimized. Uh, but uh, let's keep it for default lit for now and click on this node and right click and then convert to parameter and call it uh, sorry call it uh, go go car let's make it uh, let's name it this way go car and uh, just save and now we actually have our master material for all the basically everything in the game um, and from uh, this point here all we need is to create a material instance and we can call it whatever we want first let's uh, create let's first uh, create our um, bomb material let's create the bombs so name it bomb instance and for the bomb uh, we have only one parameter as we now created it so all we need to do is uh, change it to a color and the color i used is this one uh, 100 here 17 here 17 uh, uh, here actually sorry it's uh, 15 15 or maybe it, it doesn't really matter so this is our bomb material that you saw in the game pretty simple right uh, and we can create all of the other materials uh, like this so let's uh, get going uh, 
just create another instance and uh, name it uh, uh, end game end game uh, instance <coughs> this is our material for the <coughs> sorry this is the material for the uh, blue pillar that we need to go to to go to the next level so this one is going to be uh, again this is uh, 16 1600 beautiful absolutely beautiful material it cannot be more beautiful <laughs> so uh, the other one uh, we need is for the actually the platforms that you saw that were moving and the platforms that we need to shoot and this one is actually not so gory if i may say myself let name it platform instance and this one is uh, very simple to uh, point, uh, 0.06 and the other one is zero and we can save it and yeah uh, these are all the materials that we need uh, for our game uh, if we need any more i'm going to add it but i doubt it <laughs> so yeah let's go to the next thing actually before we move to the next uh, part uh, we <coughs> can actually apply these materials to our uh, models so go to uh, our game folder which is jump cubes and then go to assets and uh, here actually we can uh, create our assets and so far as you uh, see we have these two guys right uh, however uh, we need different uh, assets actually so if we duplicate this one and name it uh, a for asset or model whatever and we can call it endgame endgame cube so uh, open this cube here and uh, just minimize it go to your uh, material folder and the end game cube will have this material so uh, just assign this material to this object here and yeah now we have a glory cube again create another one sorry duplicate and uh, we can name this um, uh, platform we can name it a platform and this one if we open it uh, we can just apply uh, the material here and for the bomb we actually don't need to duplicate this because we have um, only one um, do we we have only one i think yeah we we have only one object that is a sphere so uh, we can just assign uh, sorry open the sphere and just assign the bomb material on the sphere if we have more objects later uh, we can add more stuff of course uh, we can actually change and create new materials and so on so now that we have created uh, most assets that we need obviously we still don't have vfx uh, also let me create another folder and name it audio we'll use this later but for now uh, we can finally go to the interesting part which is blueprints and please create your folders and everything beforehand because it makes things so much easier and uh, make sure to save save all make sure everything is safe and let's go to the blueprints part yay hey thank you for watching this video thank you for staying till the end i hope you learned something today and if you like the video please smash the like button and if you want to stay tuned and uh, to be notified when the next one comes out please subscribe to my channel i really really appreciate it and this is for this video so see you in the next one bye bye